I'm 24 7 weather meteorologist Victoria Marshall your day today Wednesday November 13th and we are running well below average for this time of the year. Very chilly conditions in place across the entire state. Besides the chill, we're also going to see that rain. You already see the greens picking up across the area. I want to start you off with the temperatures in the morning hours. It's been in the low 50s across the area, but you factor in that northerly wind component and it makes things feel even colder. We're seeing temperatures in the 50s, but it feels more like we're in the 40s. Current wind, wind chill temperature 43 in Raymondville, Harlingen, 47 in McCallum, 49 in Edinburgh. So that's what you really need to pay attention to. And that's why you need to make sure that everybody in the family is bundled up in layers this morning because as we head through the afternoon, the winds kick up. And then we also see those temperatures steadily falling off through the afternoon. The other thing that we're watching are waves of rain that will be developing through the day today in the morning hours already seeing some shower activity going primarily across the lower valley but this should increase as we head into the afternoon and it should be kind of this light steady rain in some spots you will see some moderate rainfall if you're driving on the freeways driving through school zones in the afternoons I do encourage you to be extra careful slow down and definitely uh, leave a good distance between you and the car in front of you to avoid any kind of travel headaches uh, winds will pick up as well. 15 to 20 miles per hour is what we're expecting this afternoon. Some gusts will be in the 20 to 25 mile per hour range. You add that into the 50s this morning, becoming the 40s this afternoon, and boy, it's going to feel extremely cold out there. Besides that, over the next 36 hours, we continue with the overcast skies, cold conditions, and the waves of showers moving across the area. I want to take you to future cast now where you see the greens and yellows here. That's where we're showing you where the rain should be falling. So this small Model, doing a good job of picking up the rain along the coast this morning by the afternoon expecting that this should become a little more widespread and again it's going to primarily be light rain Wednesday through 3 p.m. then through your rush hour as well but then you see here some yellows moving in uh, primarily across McAllen, Harlingen back over to Brownsville along that highway 83 corridor and onto that 77 corridor so by the late afternoon it could be some light to moderate rain falling in some cases some rain could be heavy again do encourage you to take the umbrella of the rain gear and slow down when you do encounter that heavier rain. 52 degrees, again, that happened this morning by the afternoon will be steadily falling off into the 40s by tomorrow. 50 at best in the upper valley, right around 54 in the lower valley. Friday, another cold one before Saturday. We start to see some sunshine re-emerging into the picture. A very slight chance for rain then. Then by Sunday, it's the partly cloudy skies with sun 74 degrees a front moves in overnight Sunday helping to drop our temperatures back off into the 60s by Monday everybody stay bundled up out there and again I do encourage you to check those heaters cover up the sensitive plants bring the pets inside if you can and do dress in those warm layers over the next three days.